Hi everyone, I'm Sidray9, and welcome back to Let's Play Breath of Fire 2. So right by the waterfall where we got Ryu's dragon powers, there's a cave here, and this is the last of our little side quest adventure. Wildcat Restaurant is very strict about manners. Please follow the caution notes. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, you may check in your things here. Do you want to check in? Uh, yeah. You will return your things when you are leaving. Have a good time. Now, by things, he means your items. So, he's holding all of your items. Okay. Please remove your hats here. Uh, well, you know, they want to be polite. You know, it's not polite to be in a fancy restaurant, you know, with your hat on. So, yeah, yeah, no problem. Remove their warrior helmets and leave them here. So, you don't have your helmets. But, yeah, we want to be polite. I fully understand this. This is a restaurant. Please take off your jackets here and put on a napkin. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah, you, you don't want to get your armor dirty. You know, so, yeah, yeah let's do that. See, you even get a napkin. Now, of course, it doesn't really protect you, but we're here to eat, so. <laughs> it makes sense. Please exchange your weapons and shields with a plate and a fork here. Oh, yeah, I mean, we gotta have the, the plate and the fork, gotta have the plate to put the uh, meal on, and then a fork to eat it. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. So now you have a fork and a plate and a napkin. Now we're ready to eat. Very excited. You know, this is really neat that they actually do this. Please rub salt and pepper on your bodies. Wait, what? You know, it must be one of those newfangled restaurants you know, where you have to do really crazy stuff while you eat. You know, it's one of those really exotic experiences. Okay, sure. It is really strange, but you know those, those really fancy restaurants where you get like a piece of meat the size of a quarter with a little bit of sauce and you pay $2,000 and you have to eat it while you're, you know, while you're on your, on your knees staring up at the sky or you have to be laying down sideways. You know, it's one of those really fancy restaurants. Maybe you've seen them in the news or something like that. This must be the same thing. Almost meal time. How would you like your meat cooked? Now, honestly, I'm like a medium well kind of guy. Uh, but for this, just trust me, choose rare. Huh. This looks suspicious. Wait, what? Ow, 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 ow. Hot, 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 hot. Let's see, is it done yet? Huh? Ah! It's raw? That's strange. Well, that's alright. I'll just cut it up and make bite sized steaks. <laughs> Hence why you wanted to choose rare, that's right. Boss battle time, and you don't have any of your equipment. Also, if you look at everybody's HP, it's lower than your max because, ow, fire hot. Now, you want to say yes to everything because you want to be polite, and you'll see why a little later. So just go along with everything. If you don't, you'll have to do a short fight, and then you don't get to keep your stuff anyway, if I remember right. Even if not, trust me, just be polite. This is not a hard fight, especially if you've done everything that, that we've talked about so far. Fire Dragon, Ice Dragon, Thunder Dragon, use what you want. I'm going to use Ice. Uh, we're gonna have cat attack, we're gonna have Rand, swing, sure, and we're gonna have Nina use sonic boom. So swing, 46, chop chop. Ha, I lived with 1 HP, sucker! Now he hits really hard, Wildcat. Ice Dragon, you have to worry about the whole uh, chop chop move. Take 512, sonic boom. 
swing again. And he's dead. It's that simple, as long as nobody dies from, uh, from his first attack. Especially Ryu, you need the damage. This fight, pull no stops, use the dragon. Make sure you have full AP. You, you need to really one round him because he does a ton of damage quickly, as you can see. Hey, cast level 18. Ah, I lost. If that's it, I would use my secrets. Achoo! Goodbye. And he just leaves. Huh. Well, we could leave. But I think we'll follow him. Look, he's in like some sort of bar. So, you want to talk to this person? Are you mad that I tried to turn you into steaks? No, not really. I understand you're a cook. Really? You are very forgiving. It's pretty hard to forgive someone that tried to kill you. You are soft-hearted, aren't you? Yeah, I am. Oh, I'm so glad. Now everything's fine. I'll show you a trick because you forgave me. The person who wants to learn the trick, come forward and talk to me again. Now, we're actually going to teach this to Nina. You can teach it to anybody, but I find Nina gets a lot of play out of it. Especially if you plan on using her for a while, it's I feel very helpful for her. May I teach Nita the trick? Yes, please. Okay, I'm going to teach Nita the trick. Pay attention! Nita learned how to use Chop Chop. Yes, that same move we just saw. This trick is really sharp. <laughs> Very sharp indeed. Basically to shred food. Now, as you can see, Chop Chop takes... A whopping zero AP hits one enemy and it does a decent amount of damage it's pretty pretty static I think it's between like 50 and 80 somewhere around there I will always do around they'll always do that that much damage but it's free and Nina can use it like a spell which is really good at she could Sonic Boom, and then you could take the time to uh, use Will and try to get AP back. But soon she'll learn bigger spells. Well, maybe not soon, but eventually she'll learn bigger spells. And will want to save them for bosses and do a ton of damage to bosses. So what's she going to do in the meantime? Well, she could use Chop Chop. Chop Chop is also very special. It will always do that 50 to 80 damage let, let me say that again. it will always do that because it, it ignores defense you get that damage it's static period to my memory so very good I like to give it to Nina you can give it to anybody feel free to choose but I feel that's that's a really good choice to me Um, something, if you don't do the questions right, I don't remember if you do everything else right, but uh, the, the questions here, if you don't do it right, he'll do something else. I think he gives you AP for everybody, or HP, no, no, he, if it was AP, I, I may have chose that. No, no, it's a boost to uh, HP for everybody, a permanent boost. Uh, it's not trivial, but not great. I'd rather have the spell, I'd rather have Chop Chop, but it's there, I think it's... 10 something HP so uh, that's there as well um, do we have our equipment back no not yet we feed the strong people we cook the weak people uh, that's not very nice honestly but we'll forgive you just don't do that anymore there's the bathroom now all we have to do is sleep, but there's no fights here, so... Talk to this person. 
Here are your things. Thank you for coming. Gee, thanks. And everything's how you had it. See? Including all your items. So there's the last of our side quest. I hope you had a lot of fun with it. That That's kind of uh, more funny. It's very dangerous. Just be... Be careful. You definitely want to save before you before you go in there. But follow the instructions, answer the questions like that, and you get a very nifty spell. Which I could have shown off here. <laughs> Whoops. Need to have the fire ring is, is really nice. Sleeping in the open is good. Yeah, sleep in the open. Why not? Alright. Now let's continue on with the story. We're going to need to change our party up. We're going to go Cat, uh, Jean, and Nina. I apologize if I have any native French speakers or some people that know how to speak French. I don't have the accent for it, uh, I apologize. I, I'm doing the best I can when uh, he speaks French or with his name. Okay. He could use some levels, but we'll just we'll just go go like that. You will need Jean in your party. Now he said he was the king, which. Uh, fun fact is a mistranslation and he's just a prince but this is Sima Fart Ford. remember he talked about it all you have to do is transform into a frog and then you can uh, come in uh, I think this is one of those places you can't enter during the night so if that's the case use our handy dandy time spell use time warp and uh, outside, you can't use it here. Use it outside and make it to where you can't enter. Huh, that person seems surprised up there. This is fab this fabulous castle is mine, Simafort. I'm sure all of you can see how beautiful it is. I owe all of you my life. Stay here as long as you like. Enjoy yourself. And, people of my castle, your prince has returned! Make me happy with your words of welcome! Huh? What is wrong, my loyal subjects? The prince you love so much has returned! Don't be shy, run into my arms! Is that him? Must be. Why do these weirdos appear? when the weather gets warm. What? Oh. No, no, don't do a headlock on me. You're hurting me. It's impolite to hurt a prince. Yes, yes, just a minute. You're a good boy. Huh? Hey! It's fun to be carried by my legs and arms, <laughs> but it's a little embarrassing. Everyone's looking at me and laughing. Put me down, quickly. Well, that's not right. Something's wrong. I apologize for the commotion. I am the prince of this castle, and my name is Ekaro Hop du, du Ugh, I put you that, I'm sorry. Yeah, wait, what? I'm sure you already figured out that he was an imposter. That man actually believes he's the prince. I apologize on his behalf for the trouble he caused. Huh? Money for your inconvenience, and the boat to take you back is ready for you in front of the castle. I hate to be rude, but may I ask you to leave now? You know, this doesn't seem right to me. He was so sure that he was a prince, Sean, to just be an imposter like that? Hmm. You know, this, like I said, just doesn't seem right. I mean, 
he could have been lying and he could be the real prince. Hmm. Well, yeah, I guess so. Bussy, thank you for your understanding. Have a safe trip back. But actually, we're not going to leave just yet. Thought it was strange that he became smart so suddenly. So that was it, huh? An imposter. Patap will start screaming again. Who's Patap? She's the princess. Hmm. A sharp eye like the princess, nice, but the sleepy eyes of that other man are also quite nice. The real prince and the imposter. How are we? Dis how are we to distinguish the two? It's a good question. That man looked a lot like the old Master Jean, don't you think? Yeah. This isn't adding up very well. Now, there are shops, but we don't really have access to them. Um, I don't think there's anything. Is there, maybe there's something here. Oh, a deluxe pole. That's actually a better rod, yeah. Nice. Oh, we have that. I don't think there's anything else. I don't think there's anything else here. Um. Alright, guess we'll just leave. Ah, oh, hi. You just wait. Huh? This is so heavy. I don't know if I can do it. Huh? Wait, what What are you doing? You can't do it. Damn. Wait, what? Heave. Ho! Uh, it, hey. That... That was my boat. Why did you destroy the boat? Uh, yeah, why did you destroy the boat? I was like, what are you doing? Yeah. What? <laughs> First, please, listen to my story. Okay? Alright, fine. The fact is... Uh, someone's coming. Ow, ow, ow. What's that sound? People must have dropped something when they were leaving. But who would have thought that the real Jean would come back now? Aha! He was the real Jean, which means that one that says he's the prince is an imposter. Ah, so the prince is an imposter? Yeah, duh. Yeah, I always thought so too. Now that you mention it, that man was Master Jean. He looks the same as ever. Yeah, but what's gonna happen to that guy? Oh. Hey, you two! Hurry up and guard the Prince Imposter! When you say the Imposter, what do you mean? Huh? Of course, the one in jail. Are there any other Imposters? Peter doesn't seem to realize what's going on. Ah, clueless. Poster took over because Master Jean wanders around too much. Poor guy. Maybe I'll deliver a snack to him later. You're a good guard. I like you. Uh, princess? Oh, everybody's just awful. They don't even care that he's an imposter. Why won't they say, let's kill the imposter? But she is ruthless. Uh, 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 get swim. Oh, I can't hold any more. Yeah, not good. And chance star, the kitty cat can't swim. Yeah, drowning. Yeah. Good job, princess. You killed the party. Oh my. You can't swim. You should have. Me. We didn't get a chance to
Oh my! You've gained consciousness! Thank goodness! I'm so glad you're okay. Ryu, can I punch this girl? No, Cat, not yet. I'm sorry, but if the soldiers had seen us, things would have become complicated. So I pushed everyone in. But I'm sure you understand the situation now. Yeah, yeah, I have a very firm grasp on it. Please capture the imposter and save my brother. Can do. Uh, can we get a little more info? My brother went on a trip as usual. And after a while, this imposter showed up. He fooled my father and the people and took over the country. And the people of this country are very laid back, so... Yeah, I can see that. I kind of got that vibe throughout the town. You know, it's just kind of like, yeah, you know, we're good. They really didn't care if the prince was an imposter. You know, they should care that much, though. If we don't do anything, my brother, Jean, will be labeled the imposter. Yeah, sure. Got your back. Oh, I'm ever so grateful. First, please accept these tools. Huh? What's this? These are gills. It's a tool to breathe underwater. You won't last very long under deep water, but it's good for use in this castle. Please use this to walk through the water and go to the underground dungeon. My brother should be locked up there. Oh, okay. If you go through the water, you can get to the docks. The boat there is still intact. Please use it when you want to get out of the castle. Oh, okay, great. So you have a way to get out. Uh, let's see. I don't... Okay, we can't buy items, so here. <clears throat> Welcome to the armory. Here you do have some different equipment. A long rapier, which is strong, but not as good as the flame sword if you got it. Oh yeah, forgot. <laughs> I got the flame, the flame weapon for Ryu and the flame weapon for Cat. Uh, the bronze, which again is an upgrade, but it's not if you have the heat weapon. You have iron knuckle, a crossbow, Iron armor, because I didn't have money to buy armor, which is a good upgrade. Iron mail, which Cat can wear, is a good upgrade. But again, everything, as usual, is expensive. A knight helmet, and a backlog, which is a shield that everybody can use. I'd like to buy that for Cat. I don't think I have anything on me to sell, really. Tree pole. Hmm. Item shop. As you can see, there are no more herbs. You're to the point in the game to where the you're at this point. The game really doesn't sell herbs. Thinking, well, you always want the help bottle because that's what helps you. I still like to have a lot of herbs because they're really cheap, much cheaper than the help bottle, and I can use two herbs to heal up outside of that. If you want herbs, take the boat. You gotta leave. Help bottle, wisdom fruit, cure all, uh, life pill, which is like, again, I haven't really used it, so I feel like I need to reiterate this. This is like your Phoenix Down of the game, your revive potion, etc., etc. This revives party. Smoke, worms for fishing, shrimp for fishing, and urchin for fishing. Here's where you can start buying fishing supplies. We'll need them later, believe it or not. But... Uh, for now, we'll just leave. And here... It's a motel. 50 coins per night. Expensive. We have a little bit of time, so... We'll go down here. You need the gills to be down here. Uh, there's the boat, by the way. But this is where we want to go, I think. 
Yeah. Haven't seen you around here before. Are you here to go through the leftovers? Uh, yeah. I'd like to cook a gold fly someday. A gold fly is a cook's dream. Uh, this is the... Kitchen is a competition arena for chefs. Huh. I can see that. That's not where I'm gonna go. Looks so fresh and tasty. Can't believe we have to stand guard and have all this delicious food in front of our faces. Yeah, I bet that's tough. Huh. Worms. Flies. We're making her work. We're making her work here as punishment for breaking in. She's helpful because she doesn't uh, snitch any of the food. Uh, I think it's supposed to be like steal any of the food. You know? Yeah, yeah, here. There it is. Okay. Thought maybe I took took a wrong turn. He's an unusual guy, but he draws well. Uh, hi. <laughs> what do you guys want? Don't tell me you're here to visit this idiot. Sorry, I've been ordered not to let anyone visit him. If you must see him, you have to kill me first. Do you want to? Uh... No. No, I, I don't want to fight you. You guys seem to be a little bit smarter than him. Oh, yeah. Darn. Do you have to fight him? Oh, well. Fine, whatever. You have to kill me first. Blah, blah. Yes, yes. You know, risk your lives for him? You guys are pretty stupid. You're pretty stupid for challenging me, guy. Jailer! Already resorting to Cure 3. 120. And you can take 69 back. Need to keep remembering that I have chopped. Attack! Attack! And let's show this off. Chop chop! Spark, ow! Except not really. Chop chop! 64! I said, it's a good way to give Nina a. an. a. a, a, a good hitting spell that's free. Counterattack. Chop chop. And that's it. It's really not that hard of a fight. I know you have the boss music and everything, but it's not. What good is it gonna do you to save him? Whatever, you needed to go away anyway. You're an idiot. You did it! Now we can talk to my brother. Okay. Come here quickly. My sketch is a little off. John. John. Oh, <laughs> little sister. Oh, Monsieur Ryu. I'm sorry. I can't be a be more hospitable. As you can see, I cannot entertain you at this time. But please, go ahead, enjoy yourselves. By the way, may I help you with something? Uh, what are you drawing? So, what do you think? I think the colors are quite nice. Yeah, it's it's actually pretty nice. Uh, yeah, you can, actually. You came to save me? Uh, by the way, it is a nice picture, I must say that. Oh, I'm thrilled. I made such wonderful friends. Wait a minute, I want to finish this picture. So I can give it to you as a token of my appreciation. Oh, thanks! Actually, this is probably not the time. Yeah. 
This is no time for small talk. Doesn't it bother you to be treated like an imposter? Why would it bother me? I'm just going to change from Prince John to Plain John. I really don't want it. You fool! I'm so worried about you and you don't even care! You're a fool! <laughs> no, 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 no! Don't cry. You should save your tears for the man you love. Wait, oui, I'll think of something. Just a minute. Mm. By the way, there is the royal ring. Only the royal family has the real royal ring. Huh? That's right! There is a way! There's only one royal ring in the royal house. If you could show them your ring, they'll know who is real. Alright, easy! I'm so happy for you, Pete. We're talking about you! <laughs> oh, that's right. Mr. Reed, I gave my royal ring to the witch, Nimifu. Really? Really? Get it back for me. I know it's a lot to ask, but will you do it, s'il vous plaît? It was stolen by a witch? No, no. Nimifu no is not a bad witch. She was lonely, and I gave it to her as a gift. You gave such a precious ring to a witch? What's the matter with you? Monsieur Ryu, I gave my royal ring to the witch. Oh, yeah, I accidentally uh, <laughs> talked to him again. So, we have our next destination, if you couldn't tell. But it may not be what you think. You'll see next time. So, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you had a lot of fun. As we're now continuing on with the plot after uh, getting Chop Chop. Which I got to show off. So, until the next episode, I'm Cinderella 9. Remember to shoot for the stars and take care, everyone. <laughs>